I am Batman. I mean, Average Sniper. What's up, guys? Average Sniper here, bringing you another PUBG video. And I have a confession for you guys. I'm a bridge blocker. That's right. I am a bridge blocker. Now, I stopped doing it for quite a while, but I think I have relapsed and I'm starting to do it again. I know. I know it's a dirty, dirty thing to do. I mean, why would... I mean, look at it this way. This is how much of a dirty thing it is to bridge block. You're on one side of the island, and the safe zone's on the other side of the island, and you know people have to come across this bridge where there'll be easy targets to shoot. You know this, you know? But instead of doing the noble thing, and opening up the gate to the bridge, and just waving your enemies through and saying, hey, everybody that wants to shoot me later in the game, go ahead and drive over this bridge. <laughs> I'll let you. I'll let you do that. Then you can go camp and kill me later on in the game. But instead of doing that, which is what most players recommend, I actually like to try and kill them as they drive over the choke point from the not safe zone to the safe zone. Call me crazy, but I'm just addicted to it, and I think it's an effective strategy, okay? That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> oh my god. So, um, so I was, uh, streaming last night. I was doing a silent stream last night, and all these, all the footage you're seeing is from last night's stream. It was lit. <laughs> it was so lit. It was a silent stream, because my girlfriend was sleeping in the bed right next to me, um, because that's where I have my gaming computer and everything in the room where the bed is. And uh, I wanted to stream real bad, but, you know, she had to wake up at like 2 in the morning. So I was like, fuck, I, can't, I, cannot, I cannot wake her up. So I was like, you know, I'm going to do a silent stream where I don't talk. So I played solos, and I just didn't talk at all. I had my microphone muted. I played some tunes. We had some good games. It was actually a really fun time. And I got to bridge block, which, which you're about to see coming up right here. So I almost, almost died right there. I, I went to stop the motorcycle and uh, it just did the front front wheelie. I don't know why. It just does that now. I swear you cannot hit the brakes on the motorcycle without like moving it to the side or something. I got to remember to do that because I almost die all the time. I don't know what this guy's thinking. He's like, let me just run out here with a pistol <laughs> and try my luck. Was, was he going to bridge block with a pistol? It really looked like he was going. I had to shake my head at him. I had to shake my head at him. He, he was going to bridge block with a pistol my god anyway anyway so now i'm on the bridge and i'm committed i mentioned in the stream i typed in bridge block and everybody was like yeah do it bridge block those fuckers so i was like okay chill out <laughs> i'll get on the bridge i was expecting it to be kind of boring because sometimes bridge boxes are boring people like instead of driving cars over the bridge you know they like to take boats or swim and try and flank you but not today today everybody decided Let's just drive over the bridge. <laughs> Why not? Why not just drive over the bridge? I, I had to shake my head at a lot of people just trying to drive over the bridge. Of course, they didn't know there was a bridge block going on, but it's got to look kind of shady. I mean, there's a crashed Jeep right here. There's there's loot boxes sitting everywhere. Oh, my God. Look at this guy slide. <laughs> that was amazing. Yeah, that was just amazing how far that guy went sliding down the concrete. Man. And then, then there comes another one. This guy takes a couple shots, but uh, he ends up here and then just gets mowed down. I don't know what his plan was. I, I would have kept going if I was him. But now they've basically given me enough cars. Um, they've basically given me enough cars to where I can actually uh, start setting up an actual bridge block here. Look at this guy. He's like, I'm going to come in. Yeah. And he jumps out of the car. I feel, actually felt sorry for this guy. <laughs> <laughs> he looks he looks very sad laying there trapped under his own truck. <laughs> so now I'm like I'm like okay, so this is actually turned from a bridge camp to an actual bridge block, which is which is pretty pretty difficult to do in solos to get enough cars uh, because you, unless you want to find a car, drive it to the bridge, go look for another car, drive it to the bridge, go look for another car, drive it to the bridge, you have to kill enough people out of cars to collect them. So call me a car collector, all right? Call me a car collector. Now this Jeep sitting there is stuck. It always gets stuck when it crashes there. But that's okay because I have this uh, Jeep, this Dacia. You know what? It's not Dacia. It's Dacia. Get it right. Dacia. 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 Who, who taught you to say Dacia? God. Actually, I just like to say Dacia. I don't even care. 
So I'm getting the bridge block set up. I'm like, there's too much space here. My OCD's killing me. And lo and behold, somebody brings a car to complete the incomplete bridge block. Just drives it right up here. Are you kidding me? Like, thanks, bro. <laughs> Like, that's that's exactly what I needed. So now I'm going to have to work on my uh, parallel parking skills. Never been that good at parallel parking. Uh, but this time, I'm going to have to nail it. Because i got to make sure there is no room for error. Nobody can get through this bridge block. It's not going to happen. All right? So look at this. Look at this beautiful bridge block. Yes. <laughs> that is a thing of beauty. There isn't even a millimeter space that somebody could drive a motorcycle through. The next person that drives up this thing, it, it's just not going to work. They're just gonna run right into it. Look at this guy. Look at this guy. Superman over here. Look at all those shots he's taking. Holy crap. So anyway, here comes uh, here comes another car to the completed bridge block. I was just kind of curious. I'm like, let me just see what he does here. It's, he just plows it. Boom. <laughs> he gets shot out. Bridge blocking is so awesome. I can't get enough of it. So then the blue comes in. There's a guy down there with a the sniper rifle. It's literally been there like the whole time. I've been taking shots at him, getting like one or two hits. And then he just, fuck, I shouldn't have challenged him. I, I should have just taken a car out of the bridge block and just gone. But I challenged the guy with the sniper rifle and I paid the ultimate price. Got shot in the face. Then we find ourselves on Sandhawk. Now Sandhawk is a map where, where you just kind of go crazy in my opinion, you know? I mean, you can you can camp and play tactically on any map, but on Sandhawk, I always find myself tempted to just rush the enemies. It's such a small map, and there's always like an enemy close, and there's always so much action like going on. That guy got ate up. I thought his health was lower than that because I had previously hit him, but he must have taken some time to heal. Otherwise, I would have aimed down sights, but I was, I was happy I got that kill right there without aiming down sights. I was like, whoa, he had to get hit a lot more than I thought. So this was one of the highlight matches from the stream. I was just kind of running around and uh, just having fun, shooting people. I mean, what's more fun than running around and shooting people? It's just it's just epic. <laughs> um, so uh, here I, I find myself at a point on the bridge, where by the bridge, where there's just so many people around. This guy had no idea what was happening. That guy had no idea. The last two guys had no idea what was happening. But then I get myself into a situation where I'm stuck between two snipers, and I don't have a sniper rifle. I remember what happened on the bridge. I don't. I don't want that to happen again. I just. I just do not. I hate getting sniped. Okay. So this guy up here, I figure I can rush him, kill him, take his sniper rifle, and kill the other sniper. Now everybody in the chat was like, "You're dead. You're dead. You're dead. You're dead." I saw it. I saw it pop up in the chat. People didn't have confidence in me, but the plan was executed flawlessly and I, you know what i die all the time guys i'm not like trying to be arrogant or anything like that sometimes i, I think sometimes my voice just makes me sound like i'm i'm being arrogant but i'm really not I, I i try my best not to be because i get pwned in this game so much it's not even funny but when i have good games like this i just like to share it with you guys so i i killed the one sniper got his sniper rifle and there's the other guy it's sitting right on top of the bridge and thank god i got that first shot off because you can hear his bullet was right past my face I had to give him the you're dead emote. I mean, tsh, come on. Yeah, that was, you know, I, my plan. That was literally my plan. I heard two people sniping at me. I'm like, if I can kill one of these guys, take their sniper rifle, I have a chance at sniping the other one. Otherwise, they're going to have me pinned down. You get pinned down in this game so easy, and it, it's hard to get out of it. At this point, I'm actually running from another sniper, and I just encountered this guy in the building along the way, and, uh, just kept on going and then right after that i'm just all i'm trying to do is get to the safe zone some other guy starts shooting at me from up here with some kind of dmr or assault rifle i'm not sure I, i'm thinking let me get a let me get a, a snipe on him but whoa i missed a headshot and he takes a huge chunk of my health huge chunk of my health so i'm like all right i gotta i gotta heal up real quick that was not good <laughs> That was not good at all. I never feel comfortable uh, with my heals at like 75%. I always have to do a boost if I can. It just makes me feel better. I see the guy running to the left, and I kind of figure he's not sure where I went. He he lost, somehow, he lost sight of me. So I see him at this tree. I thought I had a perfect headshot lined up, but I think what happened is the guy's arm got in the way, and the bullet went right into the guy's arm and did not go through to the head, which happens all the time. It happens all the time in PUBG. No big deal. Still pretty sure this guy doesn't know I'm flanking him, so I just kind of run up to where I can see the tree. Sure enough, he's still there, trying to figure out where I am, but it was too late. It was too late for him. My two favorite guns on PUBG PC right now, UMP and a bolt-action sniper rifle. Preferably the AWM, but I'll take the Car 98 or the M24 because of this. You got guys like this, 
that it's just gets whoever gets the first headshot basically he, he missed the headshot on me i got the headshot on him that was one of those that's one of those kills i really like where you just are kind of like surprised by the enemy and you take him out with a perfect headshot i was loving i was loving this gameplay last night it was just so much fun so now we're only 12 alive, and I'm like, man, I've been playing aggressive the whole time, so I'm just going to keep going. I know there's a guy right up here by this little sniper tower, so I just push it. Not sure exactly where he is. Right at the last second, I see him. I'm like, oh, shit. So I just do my my, my classic move where I don't aim down sights at all. I just kind of sidestep and uh, center him on my target with that hip fire. That works for me so much. I, I started doing it on Xbox, but now I do it on PC, too, because it's just, uh, I don't know. It's It just works for me. I hear another guy, but I lost uh, I lost track of him. So I'm like, okay, I got to find this guy because he, he knows I'm weak. He's trying to take advantage of that, and I got to take him out. So right here, I end up seeing him. Oh, but he somehow gets me. He got me with a headshot. I think if he hadn't got the headshot, I probably could have taken him. And then we get to our match on, and this is all. These are all uh, clips from last night's stream. It was just an epic stream. It was so much fun. It was so much fun. Um, we get to the match on Miramar, our favorite desert map. And uh, I was just, at this point in time in the stream, I was just kind of, you know, having fun, running up on enemies, killing them. I had plenty of games where I got killed, you know, and those two double-digit games were disappointing that I didn't get the dinner, but they were still fun. Sometimes you, you feel good about your games when you don't win, even if it's just because you got so many kills. You know? You're like, man, I probably had the most kills in the server, so even if I lost, it's all good. This guy got shot out of the car. I really wanted that Murado. I was going, I was running up to take it. That was my goal. Uh, you know, but he got there before me. No big deal. No big deal. Um, he got shot out of it. And I kind of thought that one, this guy actually might deserve this. Now, it, call me harsh. Call me harsh. But I just had to. Had to give this guy the old clam slam. He, he, I think he deserved that. <laughs> I think he deserved that. So I drove the Murado around literally for like 10 minutes. Switched to a buggy when it, like flipped it flipped over or something something happened it ran out of gas or it flipped over switched to the buggy we're getting uh you know there's not that many people left i'm playing a little conservative i know there's a guy in here and he's in the classic spot look i can see his head he's just right there camping the stairs i get that nasty headshot on him before he can even react um that don't camp there guys if you're playing against somebody that that has played miramar even five times everybody knows that's where people sit on the stairs if you're gonna camp do it in a place that's not that obvious that do in a place that's not that obvious so i take my buggy over here that last place i was in is not in the safe zone anymore and or what was it not in this yeah i think it was not in the safe zone anymore i find this guy i take him out he tried to do that the jump move which actually works pretty good on me but i've gotten used to people doing it so now i kind of anticipate it and i'm like my aim is ready like just in case you jump I got you. I got you. So that was, I thought that was pretty cool. He jumped through the air and kind of got shredded on his way. I think a lot of players don't expect people to jump in this game. I'm actually surprised how many people actually do jump in this game. Like it's Fortnite or something. I, I hardly ever jump in this game unless I'm trying to like sh shoot somebody through a window that I can't see over or something. That guy got eight up with the SLR. I like the SLR, but sometimes I can't figure it out. Sometimes I feel like I have to shoot people three times in the head with a level two helmet. I don't know if I'm just missing the headshots or what. I saw a guy running from the blue right here, and I thought to myself, I'm just going to stay ads Sometimes that's not a good idea in third person, but in this particular uh, scenario, it worked out. I think he was pretty wounded from the blue, so uh, I, was, uh, I was happy about that. He didn't have to peek me. That's why I shook my head at him, because he, he didn't have to peek me right there. Now we're down to only four people left. I found a bath towel and uh, decided to wear the bath towel, see if it'll give me any luck for the chicken dinner. And uh, as I'm throwing grenades at one guy, I see another guy just laying out here. This is what I'm talking about. Did I not? Did I miss a headshot and hit him in the shoulder or something? I feel like all three of those shots were right on his head. I know the last one was. It said headshot. I'm pretty sure the first one was. I don't know about the second one. But anyway, game's coming to a close. Uh, third to last guy dies in the blue. Second to last guy is no cover. It's just right in front of me. Easy kill with the SLR. Match finished. I hope you guys enjoyed. We had an epic stream last night. I just felt like I needed to make this highlight reel and talk about it. Hope you guys enjoyed. Later.